Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Nick here and I'm going to teach you right now how to create a direct mail campaign through Command. All right, so we are in the campaign section of Command and I have chosen to create a new campaign and we're going to use direct mail. So click direct mail, then we're going to name it. So the house I'm going to send a postcard about is 33 Spencer Road and that's in Glen Ridge, New Jersey, okay? So that is just so um, I know, um, you know, which which house it is. So we're going to advertise the listing for our goal, and we're going to use a template that's provided by Keller Williams, so we don't have to create our own. So let's set up that campaign, and then it brings us to KWLS. Now I want to look for the listing that I'm going to be advertising, so I'm going to search for the uh, address, 33 Spencer Road. And let's search. There it is in Glen Ridge. Select it. Perfect. It brings in all the information that we need. Uh, address, uh, country, state, town, zip, price, um, listing status, uh, just listed. Okay, over here, I want to choose this. Um, you got four different templates to choose from, all different prices, sizes, etc. Let's do this contemporary one. Actually, uh, let's do. Let's just do. Let's just do um, this one. Okay, that looks good. We'll use that one, and I don't know why, just because. Um, okay, so it is four bedrooms, so it didn't populate that, so we're just going to do four, and it is four bathrooms, so let's just add four bathrooms. And then down here, um, it brings the description from the MLS. That's going to be pictured on the back of the card, so you are more than welcome to, um, to obviously, uh, you know, um, edit that however you would like to. Um, because if it's too long or too wordy, but I'm not going to do that right now, uh, but this will be on the back of the postcard, so you can do what you like with that, but it pulls it from the MLS. That's where the description comes from. So let's save that, and now we need to choose the listing photo. All right, so um, if I choose the photo here that it pulled from the MLS, the resolution may not be high enough, depending on uh, how your MLS um, publishes the photo. So I'm just going to replace it with a photo that I know is 1800 by 3300. So I will choose that right here and it worked super easy, done. Perfect. That's going to be pictured on the front of the postcard. Let's save it. And the agent, obviously that's you or me. So we want to find our photo. So let's throw a photo of us up there and your first name, right? First, last name, a phone number, email address, etc. Let's save that. And then Market Center. Uh, we want to throw a Market Center logo in there. Make sure it's square. Um, and then there's our Market Center. We want to put the address of the Market Center. 33, uh, 237 Lorraine Ave. Uh, let's see. City is Montclair. State is New Jersey. Zip code 07042. And then let's verify the address. Okay, so it brings up the address. You want to confirm it. Perfect. And we're going to do, we'll do 200 cards for 89 cents each. Great. Let's save that. Now we're going to go to the next step. Oh, we can preview the postcard. So here's the front. Looks really nice. And here's the back. All right. And let's click out of there. Um, I, wanna, I want to have a call to action. I want to have a QR code on the back of my card. So when it gets delivered to the person's house, um, they can scan it with their phone and they can see a, a landing page that I assigned to this card and their information will then be sent into command as a lead. So let's toggle that and turn on the tracking. Now I have designed a landing page for this property and it is in my landing page library. So you have to create it before uh, before you make the card. So if you watch my landing page creation video, uh, this is how you would then attach that landing page to the card. So let's choose the one for 33 Spencer Road. And uh, we are going to configure targeting. So move on to the next step. Configure targeting. Are you sure you want to create the campaign? campaign? Yes. Moving on to the next step. Let it fill all that information in for us. You got to give it a second there. Okay, awesome. So if you haven't done a postcard on command, it is so cool because it allows you to target 
just like you're targeting a Facebook ad, which is really awesome. So um, this is where the house is right here, smack in the middle. And there's a bunch of houses around it. Um, number of houses that we're targeting right now, it's 200. But if you want to up it to 300, you can definitely do that. It'll just, you know, ex broaden, expand it out further. Um, so it is a single family home. So we want to choose the property type. Okay. And the bedroom. So um, obviously it's not 30 bedrooms. The great thing about this is you can target homes that are similar to the house that you have just listed or just sold. So you can see over here, the blue dots will start to get, um, will start to lessen a little bit as I start to narrow things down a little bit. Okay. So three to five bedrooms, square footage. This house is um, about 2,100 square feet. So I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to do 20 houses, about 2,400 square feet um at most and i'll go to like 1800 square feet okay so now we see um some of the blue dots are dispersing a little bit the year built um this is new jersey so it's probably a very old house so let's do like 18 um let's do like 1890 1887 to 19 30 let's do 1939 or 1940 all right so last sold i don't know when it was last sold but if i was the listing agent then i would so i'm just gonna say okay let's just say it was last sold in you know 2010 between 2011 and you know 2005 whatever you know what i mean um you guys can obviously you'll know that and then what it last sold for. So let's say it last sold for between 500 and uh, seven, like, you know, 825 or, or whatever. Okay, so now it's starting to narrow things down a little bit more for us. Uh, we're going to want to narrow this in a little bit. And so now, let's see, we don't want to do, maybe we want to do 100 homes. Let's see what that does. Okay, and so what we can also do is now that we started to, to, to narrow this down, um, because it's such a specific area, we can also do a polygon so we can draw on the map. So let's draw a little bit. Let's do, okay, I want to target homes from here to here to here, oop, here, and let's just kind of bring it up there so i will only want the homes in that area but maybe i want to expand a little bit see if that fills in the uh see if that fills in more of the circles for us bring this out a little bit okay uh, maybe last sold we'll bring this up okay so now we have only 25 homes but what's interesting is that because New Jersey is such a such a interesting area, um, you know the houses are all different. Um, you know, there's really they're built at all different times. They're older homes. Um, you know, you're gonna have uh, you're gonna have very very classic homes here. Um, so it looks like right now uh, that I that that this was a just sold. I'd be sending it to only about 25 homes but but that's okay uh oh only 104 let's reset so you can also reset so the point of the matter is like you can find homes that are similar to the house that you are listing or that you're selling um depending on the different criteria so you know you can change them around Here we go. Let's do that. I'm just showing you kind of what this does here. So depending on the type of home that you are listing, um, or selling, you can target it accordingly and send it uh, to homes that kind of like, you know, meet that criteria. So um, you guys can choose the targeting, right? So you're basically done. Um, you know, I obviously want to send a copy to my address and it shows you how many, how many homes you're sending it to, how much it costs. So we're going to go to next 
and it will create a preview for you um, and show you kind of what the front and the back of the card look like. So we can wait for a second for that to happen. Um, and it just kind of, you know, gets delivered uh, within seven to 14 days. Um, and the cards look really, really beautiful. Uh, and so here's, here's the different, uh, here's how it looks. So you see the front, you see the back, you got the QR code here. So when the, when the person who um, gets the card at their home scans it, uh, their information will be then sent into command as a lead. And, um, you know, we can, let's view a larger one here. This is nice.